My name is Rubina. I come from a diverse background. I was born and raised right here in central Pennsylvania. My parents are originally from Africa. My dad's from Ethiopia. My mom is from Kenya, Nairobi. And that's also from uh, where my husband is as well. My family's from Africa, but we're, all, we're Indian. I'm not uh, Pakistani by descent. So that in itself was confusing. Yeah, growing up around here was not easy. My family's from Elizabethtown, Pennsylvania. It's a very small town with a very small diversity, um, you know, religion-wise and culturally. We've grown immensely um, since then. My, my parents and my family have lived here for around 35 years, and we didn't have a lot of diversity. So when I do meet somebody that um, is from a Muslim background or um, you know, somebody that has a different background, diverse background in general, I will connect with them. My dad was actually one of the founding board of directors for um, the mosque that exists right now, which is the Islamic Society of Greater Harrisburg. Right now, I think because of the political climate and everything like that, uh, there's more, you know, push about religion and Muslims and non-Muslims and things like that. But, you know, growing up here was more about skin color. It was either black or white. And then to see, you know, an Indian family living in Elizabethtown where there are like very little Indians living. There's maybe, there was maybe like only two families at that time. Um, so they didn't even really know what to classify us by. Uh, a lot of times we were mistaken um, for like a Hispanic family or a Latino family. I don't think um, brown, as <laughs> to say, was like really you know, a topic or a discussion or a classification at that time.